Hey everybody, welcome back to Recordology. Where in the world am I? In downtown Lakeland, Florida, because there's a record show here, the Lakeland Record Fair, volume three. I think that means it's the third year they're doing it. It's right down here in the heart of downtown Lakeland. So let's check it out. Beautiful sunny day and I am excited to check out a new record fair I love record shopping flipping crate digging all that good stuff I, it's here at the rec room I don't know if there's like a cover charge or how this works so we're about to find out in real time you and me it's like an arcade and bar kind of deal okay cool not a huge space but there's records and that's the most important part so let's check it out I was love a good movie soundtrack so it'll be a lot of fun hopefully we find some treasures Ooh, look at that the haunted <laughs> Disneyland haunted house record a couple versions of it so that'll be a lot of fun Muppet movie cool country and bluegrass so be fun interesting setup definitely not like anything I've seen before this is definitely unique interesting oh it's a platter mat I thought it was like a acetate or something you got the king right there oh I love kids records Tom Sawyer some Peter Pan records down there The thrill of the hunt, right? It's always the thrill of the hunt. What will we find? This is cool. Look at that. Top album volume two sealed, $170. Cool. Yeah, it's pretty cool. All right, let's go into the uh, main area. It's primarily put on by one record shop, but then there's like other companies that have contributed as well. So. This is wild. It's like a nightclub atmosphere in here. See some CDs over here. Always love a good CD. Stan Getz. Wow. This is cool. All right. Time to do some picking. You guys see anything that you would go for? Always want to know what you guys want to see or would uh, snap up if you were given the chance. Also, do you guys have any events like this in your area? Would love to know if you uh, have been to a show lately and what you found. Got some cassettes here as well. Absolutely still listen to cassettes. In fact, I just bought one yesterday. I'll be doing a live show soon where we talk about the records I've picked up lately. I have picked up quite a few lately. Look at this, six dollars each or four for twenty. Got a wall of albums back there. People enjoying things. And ooh, picture discs. Oh, got some more cassettes here. Like I said, always love cassettes, absolutely. So let's see if we can find anything we can't pass up. Farewell, Summer Love, Michael Jackson. It's like a boot What is this? Weird. See, I like this. I think I had this as a kid. I like that. Did you spot it before I did? Very cool. I have this on CD, so I'm not going to pick it up, but still cool to see. Also, I like these uh, Jeff Fox really la Laughing Hyena tapes. I actually had some on CD. Yeah, they still called them Laughing Hyena tapes, even though they were on CD. More CDs here. Still have not found anything yet. Hope I do. That'd be a bummer to come here and not find it records. Maybe this is more of my style. So we can find some stuff in here, maybe. Hopefully. The old nemesis of the channel. 
You have to be a long time viewer to get that. Kenny Rogers, Herbie Man, and others. Still not finding anything I can't live without. Total bummer, dude. I've got a budget and everything. Some records loosely in there. Yeah, it's total bummer. That Barry Gibbs there. I want to find something. Come on. What the heck? Some uh, Beastie Boys playing in the background. Here's some uh, record store day titles. Jazz boxes over here. Always interested to find. Big band titles, Glenn Miller, of course. Absolutely, never know what you're gonna find. I've said that a couple of times, but that's the thing about it. This is coming back for more. All right. I think I've seen about all of it. You can even buy clothes. I didn't get anything. Just didn't see it. A couple of things were like kind of interesting, but. I don't know, it just, prices were high, selection was kind of minimal. I don't know if I'd come back to this one again, but it was interesting. It was a uh, definitely experience. It's always fun, because you never know what you're gonna find. If you always got something good, it may not be as exciting, because it's the thrill of the hunt. Will I find something today, or will I not? Today was not, but that's okay. So anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Happy record hunting. See you next time.